morning, 47. Your target is the infamous serial killer known as the Censor, with a flair for the theatrical. The Censor acts as an examiner who grades his victims based on how much they struggle for their lives. The true identity of the Censor is unfortunately unknown, but the discovery of two recent victims indicates he's now exploring Whittleton Creek, Vermont, in search of prey. We only have a limited window of opportunity here, 47. Find the sensor and make sure he never grades anyone again. Best of luck. Welcome to Vermont, 47. The sensor should be somewhere in Whittleton Creek, looking for a potential new victim. He will likely seek out places where people are gathered, so I suggest you look for crowded areas. Oh, geez, darling, I'm so hungry. This Have might be the place, 47. A garden party would be the ideal location for the sensor to identify his next victim. Ironically, this is exactly what you should do as well. He doesn't censor anything. He grades people. Wouldn't it be more fitting to call him the evaluator? Yes, clearly. It's quite frustrating, actually. But what do you think about him? Any idea what drives a man like that? Maybe he actually is an evaluator. I mean, I would also feel like killing someone if I had to grade high school essays all day. But he's probably just a sadist who loves to see people suffer. I don't think it's that. Oh. So let me hear your theory. I think he's looking for someone who will challenge their fate. Maybe he sees that everybody has the potential to be a killer, and he wants his victims to realize and act out that potential. That is an oddly specific theory. Oh, well, it's just a theory. One can only dream. At the Gorka Museum in Barcelona, impressionist master Emil Gorka's most celebrated work, the artist as a blank canvas, has been... Your house is so beautiful. beautiful. I'm the really impressed with the wonderful things you have here. I wish my husband would let me have that much art inside the house. But he gets, well, <laughs> he doesn't appreciate it the same way I do. Well, Richard and I have similar interests, so it's really not that hard to get to go along with my ideas. Charming. Although I, I have to say, for it's been challenging to find a good place for my old microfilm viewer. Right now, it's just collecting dust in the attic. Microfilm? That's a interesting thing to collect. Well, it's sort of a hobby that never really took off. Besides, I don't have any microfilm to play on the viewer anyway. I'm not sure I could find any either. Hmm. Yeah, well, 
Don't you? Very interesting Sorry, indeed. You and you, so sir, rude. you look quite interesting yourself. In fact, so I, I will you. never I can imagine you soon. In you look like you're great. You ever again. Now, you're all smug and, oh, I'm so smart. Shit, look at yourself. You're a sorry youth that can only point out faults with other women. You psychologists such as the renowned Oscar Lafayette to conclude that the censor harbors a death wish and may long to be killed by one of his would-be victims. Until then, citizens of Vermont are strongly advised to lock their doors and resist the urge for vigilantism and misplaced heroics. A new indie film festival in the memory of cult Italian film director Dino Pasco opens in Sapienza. You shouldn't waste your life looking down at your phone. You never know how much time you have left. A lot more than you if you're in the habit of condescendingly telling strangers what to do. Hey, you never know when you'll run into some psychopath and piss him off. Oh, you're definitely right about that. Good. I'm glad we agree. It's not cool to go around judging strangers. I would never judge. I only grade. Sorry, what? Nothing. You should keep an eye on this one, 47. A neighborhood barbecue party. How suburban. Mm, my belly is rumbling a little. Want to go inside? Hi there. It's terrifying. How come the sensor hasn't been caught yet? 
Hi, lovely suit. You look sharp. Don't worry, citizen. I'm pretty sure the authorities are closing in on him and watching over you. Don't worry. I'm sorry, but who the hell are you? And did you just call me citizen? You're coming on a little strong. I was just trying to make conversation. Back off. I assure you. Sorry. Bye. Transferred. Now to find an exit. 